Pardon. Can we observe silent prayers? For And uh, we will do our utmost, as always, to make sure we'll do justice to the questions that would come our way. Without wasting time, we want to assure everybody that is here, as we usually do APRC, there will be question and answer session at the end of the press conference. And uh, when we reach there, the rules, as usual, would be made known to each and every one of you here. Once again, thank you for coming. Thank you for answering to our call. And uh, we'll always keep working with the media. That is what we are well known for. And for the audience as well, party members, sympathizers, and those that are following online, we're telling you welcome yet to another APRC press conference. Without too much ado, I would want to hand over to the party leader of the APRC, His Excellency, the Right Honorable Al Haji Fabakari Tombong Jata. Oh, you be lahim in a Satan Rajim, Bismillah Rahman Rahim, Alhamdulillah, he Rabbil Alameen. Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen. Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen. I thank Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for granting us this opportunity and this day. I want to salute and recognize and applaud the various media houses here in present for taking time to answer to our request. <clears throat> you are most welcome, as our spokesman said. I will also appeal, and I will speak in English, but I will make a summary of my speech in Mandinka, so that not only the English speakers, but our local people will be able to follow and understand. <clears throat> I will take this opportunity, first of all, to thank the APRC National Executive Committee members. From my two deputies to the last person, I thank you for your loyalty, commitment, and sacrifice. The last four or five years. I am more than grateful. We could not have reached where we are today without your efforts. I also want to thank 
all our APRC structures, from the village ward consequency region and our structures outside in the diaspora, your committees and the entire membership. I want to thank you from the bottom of my, from the bottom of my heart on behalf of the National Executive Committee. I want to thank our youths, our women, our elders council held by Agenda to Betty Sen and all APRC elders in this country. Our National Assembly members, our councillors, Women's Bureau councillors, our Yai Compins, members of the APRC Students' Wing, the Jamme Kunda family of Al Haji Dr. Yaya Abdul Aziz James Junkun Jamme. They are welcome, we appreciate them. <coughs> It has been a very, the former president, Sheikh Professor Al Haji Dr. Yaya Abdul Aziz James Junkun Jame, left the source of this country for Equatorial Guinea. We are all aware that it was meant then to bury the APRC alive. Thank God. With the help of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, and of course, you, the Gambian militants of the party. We were upright, we were resolute, and prepared to surmount all difficulties to reach where we are today. I thank you very much. We are all aware of that. During those difficult times, we want to thank all those people from within or without, openly or covertly, who were able to give us courage, to sympathize with us, to help us, both material, morally, all of them, wherever they are, we are thankful. We know and we acknowledge it. We are thankful to you all. Despite these challenges, we must recognize that we only achieved what we have achieved. Because if you remember at the dawn when we started, we said we are an opposition with a difference. We are disciplined, we believe in Allah, and we are hardworking. We respect authority. I've said it several times. We are not the opposition that believe that whatever government does is bad because you want to come to power. We salute you when you do good. We will cry foul when things go around. The same standard principles we hold then are the same principles we hold today. We want to make that very clear. I am aware yeah, yeah. that we also have amidst us, that was coming in a different thing, I never knew they were here, but we also have our partners, our quali our alliance partners, the NPP National Executive, led coalition National Executive, some of them are here. We salute you, we thank you. We will, we will come to that. I never knew you were here, but we will come to those things. <coughs> So as I said, we, knew, we all know what we went through. The challenges, the sufferings, the abuses we underwent. But despite that, 
we were tolerant and disciplined. It is only that that Allah guided us to this, to this level. I want to urge all APRC militants, despite the current circumstances, uh, pre prevailing circumstances, let's continue to abide by those salient qualities of discipline and respect. Despite the pronouncements of His Excellency Yaya Jami, last Friday at Kanilai, however hot we may be, however challenging it may be, we must recognize and acknowledge that former President Yaya Jami had been our president for 22 years. Former President Yaya Jami has been the leader of this party for 20 years. We cannot, under any circumstance, forget that. Because we know and we recognize that he had transformed this country unbelievably during those difficult 22 years. His pronouncements of last Friday, I believe and sincerely believe that was as a result of ill advice and misadvice by people who pretend to love him, but honestly, they are the people who don't love him and the APRC. <laughs> After all these challenges, despite what may, whatever might have happened, we believe the right thing was for him to call the National Executive Committee to express his reservations or whatever, and no other person, if we are to we are to ensure the, the continuous understanding within the political, within the APRC. Therefore, there has been a lot of speculation, talks, allegations, insults, over this period, even well before it. I want all known APRC members to be disciplined, refrain from insults, respect elders, and give your faith to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Those who shout mostly don't have ideas to battle with. So I want to urge that very much. We as a party, indeed as a democratic party, believe that in any democratic process, they are bound to limits. For in my last press conference, I gave the press the detailed process we underwent to reach an agreement. During that process, people can express dissenting voices. You can converse for others to join your camp. All those things are, are fundamental and we believe in them and it is the beauty of democracy. But it has limitations. After all the processes, after all the due process is completed. And this one is finally taken. Your right to dissent ends there. You have two options. You either toe the line and accept, or you can leave. 
and do something else. Because after the due process is completed and decision is taken, you will step on other people's right. So for those new to the coalition, immediately when we started the process, there were dissenting voices. We appreciated, we acknowledged, we talked to people, we went around the country, we came back, analysis were done, and then decision was taken. From that day onwards, any other person saying otherwise, be it me or any other person, You, uh, you have exceeded your rights. And that for us is contempt. But we stayed put. We kept quiet. We tried to go to people and explain to them because it's politics. But it is a known fact anywhere in any political dispensation, in any democratic dispensation. Even if you go to elections, people have dissenting voices. But immediately results are announced and, uh, uh, announced and accepted, that person becomes your president or your member of parliament or whoever he may be. APRC is a party for all Gambians. No political party can be formed and registered in this country without fulfilling the legal requirements in the Electoral Act and the Constitution. Political parties are Gambian parties. In fact, one of the requirements in registering political parties is to make sure you have your registered members from all the regions of this country, not to make it a regional political party or a tribal political party or a family political party or uh, a, 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 a local CAFO political party. Political parties have set criteria for formation according to the law and you meet those requirements to, to be able to register uh, political parties. And the leaders of political parties would hand over the baton from one leader to another. It will continue until to those who, to generations yet unborn. We, in the leadership of the party, we like it or not, we will hand over the baton someday. And those people also will hand over the baton. And these are done through democratic processes as per the laws of the political parties. Today, The management and operations of the Alliance for Patriotic Reorientation and Construction, APRC, falls on our soldiers. Yes, on our soldiers, on behalf of the membership of the Alliance for Patriotic Reorientation. To this end, the APRC National Exec Executive Committee, after all due processes, has signed an MOU for an alliance with the NPP-led coalition on 2nd September 
To this end, we want to send signals and warning to the GANU leadership that it is misleading and illegal for anybody to use the name APRC to be in alliance with any other political party other than the NPP-led coalition. And we want to urge our partner political parties, when I mean partner, I mean all other political parties, that we must all try, despite our desire to be leaders of this country, show examples of exemplary leadership and honesty to the people we live to the people of our parties and indeed to the entire Gambian populace. We will not hesitate. I will repeat, we will not hesitate to take any legal or any other stop, step necessary to prevent anybody From, from taking us for granted. <laughs> to this end, I, from today I am directing the Secretariat, the Admin 1 and 2, to write to the IEC, the Inspector General of Police, and of course IPC, that is the Inter-Party Committee, To warn all people to desist from using our name and our emblem. Furthermore, we want to urge and inform Ghana leadership. And even to those who no longer who see themselves as part of Ghana, who were former APRC members, whoever they may be, to desist, to desist from using APRC color, APRC symbols at their political gathering. APRC is open. It's a Gambian party. Those who have gone can come back. Those from other political parties can join the APRC. Equally, some members of the APRC may decide to go to other political parties. It should be a battle of ideas and not insults for us. I also want to make something very clear. It's unfortunate. That the alliance with NPP that as I Fabakari Tombonjata as a Muslim want to make it abundantly clear that our former president, His Excellency, Sir Professor Al Haji Dr. Yahya Abdul Aziz James Junkunjami, was aware of this coalition move. I stand and I will I will swear to the Holy Quran at any level. Two, when it was happening, it was not only me. It was in the presence of Usman Rambo and Yankuba Kuli. Yes, that's true. In my presence. Three, I have seen somebody here 
who is very close to him. I don't want to mention the name. He was even sent to me by him on this very issue. <laughs> yes, you can agree to something and later disagree. Yeah. But we must acknowledge the fact that it, had, it, 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 it came to notice. Two, I believe that all the sacrifices we have made and have cont we continue to make is purposely for the Gambia, for our Green Party and its membership, and for him, our former leader, Yahya Jang. So I want to say this. I told you earlier, I believe, that's my opinion, that he did what he did last Friday as a result of ill advice and misadvice. That's what I said. But I believe, if we are all honest, if AQ wants to talk to any other person other than the uh, national executive, you should advise him to, no, sir, please talk to the national executive. Otherwise, you are equally guilty and being very hypocritical. The next step The National Executive Committee had discussed and agreed that all those people who are in NAM, what you call the non no alliance movement, movement members, or what? All those people who are aligned to them and their whole positions within the different structures of the APRC from the village to the national executive are hereby relieved of their positions in those yeah. executives. Yeah. Can you repeat this? Let me repeat for clarity's sake. All those who align themselves with the no to, no to the Alliance, Alliance movement. movement or rebel. And they hold executive positions within the various structures of the party from the village level to the national executive level. Village, consequency, sub-ward, ward, consequency, region, and the national executive. Or in the youth, youth group, youth, women group, council. elders council, the, the student league, all those people. If you hold position like you are chairman or you are that, you are that, you are relieved from that position. <laughs> and we are directing all the desk officers and their regional chairpersons to ensure that these people are identified and their places are uh, uh, replaced ten uh, temporarily before we go into Congress. I hope that's very clear. <laughs> We also, I also, we also want to declare that last Thursday, today is Thursday, last Thursday, we had an executive meeting here. We reached an agreement, I think that was the fourth. We reached an agreement, 14th rather. We reached an agreement that should be executed latest on Monday. The event has been overtaken. Thursday, Friday evening, we had this different announcement. But that notwithstanding, what we had agreed, and I will make that pronouncement today, that Honorable Abdul Jaju, our national youth mobilizer, has been relieved of his position. Consequently, 
our youth structure, we have the National Youth Mobilizer, the first Deputy National Youth Mobilizer, and the second Deputy National Youth Mobilizer. That's our structure. Consequently, we have appointed this, his first Deputy National Youth Mobilizer to act in his position. That's Andre Bulpa Matarndao. And the second deputy national youth mobilizer now acts as the first deputy national youth mobilizer, Councillor Fatu Jallo. In addition, it has been decided that from that first day, Honorable Abdul Jaju and Bakari Saibo Sani are no longer members of the National Executive Committee. <laughs> consequently, consequently, we are aware that former Deputy COP, that is the Chief of Protocol, Deputy to Ajabatur, Mamadou Lamin Jame, Mohamed Lamin Jame, has been is named in the, the new <coughs> It's not an executive, it's the, the new, new committee. 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 <laughs> to that end, earlier than today, about three weeks, yes. a month ago, yes. we were suspicious and we have evidence that most of the executive committee meetings that are leaked out were done through him. And then we removed him from the executive forum. Since that day, to date, we have not had cause to have accusing each other people giving out information. Therefore, this is now a decision. Former COP, uh, Mohamed Lamin Jammeh, is also relieved of his position as a member of the National Executive Committee. We will, we, will, we will inform you of his replacement in due course. This alliance, that's the alliance APRC and the NPP led coalition is done in the best interest of this country. Over the years, up to more recently, there were a lot of allegations, insults. That we were bribed, vehicles, millions of dollars. We were sent money and we chopped it by Yaya Jame. A lot of things. You all had it. I thank God I can defend myself. My only weakness is, as a leader, I must be willing to, for everybody. To throw, what, to throw whatever they want on me. I don't, I don't mind it. What is clear is my conscience is clear. And what Allah knows, that's the final. But I want to make it very clear. And I challenge anybody. That Fabakari Tombo Njata, because you cannot bribe me. I cannot be bribed. I am a Muslim. I have conscience. Even if I were told, it would have been my youthful ages. But just a step to the graveyard. What I have not done as a youth. We have done this in the best interest of the Gambia, the best interest of the APRC, and the entire membership of the APRC. 
It's a sore way. In fact, it's a sore way. We were the people in government. We were the ones removed. We were the ones bullied. We were the ones alleged against. This alliance is definitely one of the sorest ways to reconcile Gambians and ensure peace and stability in this country. I urge all APRC militants, sympathizers, members, and indeed all well-meaning Gambians to vote for President Adam Abbaro <laughs> as the flag bearer of the alliance uh, of the alliance on the fourth of December, twenty twenty one. Only then can we be assured of a peaceful, stable, and progressive Gambia. I am aware that so many well-meaning Gambians from all, all, folks, all parts of the country of various categories are grateful that APRC is in alliance with the NPP-led coalition. We acknowledge, appreciate, and we salute you people. We have in our midst Hen Honorable Edu Gomez. We have sailed together in the APRC since the onset, when he had never been or never thought to be to hold any position in the party. He's still with us. We thank you for sparing that time. And I must also thank our brother. We know. He's a terrific writer. Mm -hmm. His Excellency Sam Sidin Sir. I want to seize this opportunity to thank the leadership and their members of our coalition partners. I further want to salute and thank His Excellency President Adam Abaro <laughs> for his leadership qualities, but in particular his undiluted commitment to reconcile Gambians to consolidate the peace and stability our country has been known for. We want to assure them that we are more committed to the Alliance than ever before. We are resolute and that we are prepared to surmount every difficulty to win victory. I cannot conclude without a few notes I have taken. Our chairman of URR, Al Haji Bajoko Dukure, yeah. with his desk officer, Pa Amadou Suso. We want to salute you and thank you for with your entire people, the entire people of URR, for your support throughout these difficult times. Al Haji Esanjai, Chairman 
CRR, which is Death Officer, Right Honorable Senim Bai, on behalf of the APRC Executive and Membership, we thank you very much for your steadfastness during this difficult journey. Equally, the chairman of NBR, North Bank, Alhaji Omar Drame, with this officer, Kansilo Palamin Jiba, we extend to you our gratitude. LRR chairperson, chairman, Sister Fah Sabali, and his desk officer, Al Haji Sul. We do. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala grant him Jannatul Firdaus. The chairman, Al Haji Karamo Koli, and desk officer, Honorable Al Haji Sankun Jammi. With the, with the entire people of LA, uh, West Coast region. We want to thank you. You've been with us through thick and thin. Kanifi municipality, we have Right Honorable Muhammad Lamin Drame <coughs> and uh, Death Officer Pa Ibrahim Sonko and the entire membership of KMC. We want to salute you and thank you. <laughs> Last but not the least, Banjul, our capital. <laughs> Chairman Sheikh Kam. And of course, the desk officer, Right Honorable Ablai Sen. <laughs> and the entire people of Banjul, we want to thank you for all your efforts, especially during those difficult days. Our National Women Mobilizer, Ajaratu Aishatu Jifanga Jaju. And our Deputy National Women Mobilizer, Ajaratu Mberi So, and your entire women populace. We want to thank you very much. You are the backbone of the Green Party. Our National Youth Mobilizer, Honorable Pa Matarndao. And your deputy, Councillor Ajaratu Fatu Jallo. And the entire membership of the APRC Youth Group. We salute you and we thank you. Thank you. Our National Elders Council, Chairperson Ajaratu Betty Sen. <laughs> assisted by Palum and the entire membership of the Elders Council. We recognize you, we appreciate you, and we thank you for all your efforts. Our National Students Wing, headed by Fabel Jaju, and your entire membership, we want to thank you very much. Now we go to our brothers in the diaspora. We have the chairman of the USA branch, Al Haji Jibril Fadia. <laughs> and all APRC militants and sympathizers in the United States of America. We all know Jibril, <coughs> a very honest gentleman, par excellence. United Kingdom, we have Usman Panjak Baji. We want to thank him with an entire membership within the United Kingdom. Usman Panjak is a man of principles. And of course, EU branch, Al Haji Babandinta. We salute and thank him with the entire membership. Of the, uh, of the EU, within the EU. And uh, we want to thank also all our sub-branches anywhere in the world 
from Mauritania to Senegal, West Africa, Africa, Europe, Far East, anywhere you may be, we want to thank and salute you. He's here. But you find out whether he's around. We are not taking the system. I also want to take this opportunity to single out our APRC National Assembly members and our elected councillors. They are our mouthpiece wherever they may be representing us. We salute them, we thank them, and we encourage them to continue the fight. Our APRC security, our APRC protocol, Bator and your team, our finance people, Senim, Honorable Senim Bai, our logistic people, Pai Ibrahim and your team, and above all, the nerve center and backbone of the party, our mobilization team. In this circumstance, I want to single out and thank our mobilizer general, former Lord Mayor of Kanifi Municipality, <laughs> Al Haji Yankubakuli, and his deputy, Paseni Badi, otherwise known as Obama Badi. I, it's not easy, but I know of people who are not here, who are daily calling me on difficult times, sometimes using their resources, their brains to give advices, to counter things. I may not remember all, but I cannot forget a brother. who is no other person than Bala Gaba Gahumpa Akson. <laughs> and I also honestly want to thank Ben Roberts, Benjamin Roberts, <laughs> and many others. I salute. I just want to make a summary in Mandinka. Aslam alaikum mulbe. Me minga min fo angale kan to left a wolde bandi mo fula. Man ah angale kan to left a wolde bandi mo fula suru a kamoto. Fulo fulo on kanga mo be konton. Nga mol min beto fo nge konton. Nko, Tonya, 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 na in slow me ngata, kabi in 2017, slow le min koleata diminta bak. Kato watu la mol lafta mbade lale, mamfa folo. Bari mi yatina, wamano, wale mna kuluo, na fama jio, aninga song alama. So nko, wo kuluo ni famajio anin ka son ala la kerola mo kanat na nga bot min be banandrola ibe kamolala ibe moltiyala alini ala sasidron anwa wato kono mol be jele min yalon ko yamu tam fe dol be maborin ba dol ye mako yi hakirola dol fengola momo ye mako rok ngo ngeten se ka tuma atol mi yalon ko wokole ya kono natol lem fo alay ftandi bila ngal tentu bak nko mbenga lon ko wa arjuma tambila his excellency yaya jammi ay ay kuma lef nko wo be ko la tonya bari ngante nga hakilo dum ko 
ni yaya jami anto la nyim banko marala sa nyim wang anim fula ni yaya jami akira anto la patio nyaton ko tle sa nyim wang anu nyaton ko bu nya fennem nko anatra ka mol nen na ka mbara nen ci kwa moki adu kore ali ngadna kulwota nga horomo ni respecto dia nko ala yen dia mo nte fe molle ya molle ya ya mari ila ya maro man betia kada lo jalo ko mbe yen do ko min bela ndol ni ala tema mba ke kan na bankole na patiole alin tol be ati dabo ko nko anna tra la fta dia mo leene ni wolo fana mo molti minute linta na la fta dia mo sa fay ko hanide alta ini 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 executive ye dia bal ni wo manke o to fana mo tilimbalo leti nko ndol sonta la ko fama president ya ya jammi ay kata ko ke nyim banko kan mi ya lon ko ata tutu nola ay ruwa sambana nyim banko kan ni ana jawol fo ngoto tutu nola o ton ko du kare kam fa nyaw nyana nyam hadi badi ngolem beti bo ali nga sabaro ta nga wakilo ta ngo fana anna tay kam min fo wolle keda wadan kulle be ni yaya jamme tema wala sin kol sin kuma ni nol kul na badin bunne do nga ka cha nga ba ngo fana fo nga fe yalon ko demokrasi be je nin ku boyta mo be to chonna nyola dolu ba fula nyin dolu ba fula nyin dolu ba fula nyin Omu demokrasi le te nwa man jawu ya ndol son te kwa man jawu ya bar hum ye fe ngo fe nge dan dula le bala ni ta mi ta ge lo don ti aro nat wo ka cha kono ista no mol ya le ye ha kilo ye le man ni te bi daman to ye tara woto ni ndom fa ne ta mol ya mo mo ye mol ni ni ye kuma ka mo bar ni wo ta ta ke ta fa ke ta fu nga bang mi mbe nga nda ke ta ke ta fo nja ta fo di su no ta ta ite mali le raidan ta wolto kuflal tribul yesong mo be mo jama son ta min wore finti bi ta damen to itaji bari le raid sain ka ribel man bari ko nyim mol min ben a nam kabirin to ngadi sono ta on the 2nd of september an sa ngi bulale ba kan dulum because un ko politikole mata do ngadi amu molie to man do be jelal fom fara bitlo nko aprc patiole mi ya longo gambia ko le tam kon na constitutiono anin politiko la luwal ya fo nyami nko jaton ko le binare bita ndo ndo bola jele mbe na mbe mbe mbadi la dole la wolu fana mbe bola jele ibadi la dole la ibadi la dole fa wolu ma wolu folo fa wolen political patriot wala tinna ni be parti o londi la luwa e min sabatindi because e mallafa ay ke regional party ay ke badin party ay ke si party ni be parti o londi la luwa do ko Rikono rikon ibe yi mon nan kamo bon la jil so ay ita be bon ni la west coast anin ke em ibe ta rikono le bel to rikono rikon ngan tamin so la jil pura ki gambia patriot o to aprc mo gambia patriot ndolo mi be je bi be bala gel do le bina do le bina ko loi ala ndi nyami nko mbalo la mol la ko ka bolan september sekon luma min na ngani mou sign ni npp kabo luma la aprc ani npp le coalition ngeda klimolti ningon ngeda klimoti wolemu 
Nous avons le président Adama Barolo Soto pour que Kato Fayaï, pour nous faire la finale en décembre, nous avons la boxe pour nous faire gagner. Nous avons le combat de la Côte. Le parti de Kérin Gambia n'a pas de NPPT. Nous avons le boulot de Nyola. Nous avons le combat de la Côte. Nous avons le combat de la Côte. Mbé dandalala Aïda yi kafo Wadang kake Wadang kasefe Kafo ko APRC ni mpati dole be alliance Na manke NPP Nko mbeletolo safela Sekretaya mbeletolo safela IEC Mba safela IDP Ani interparty committee Ke kalamutan ninyinna Mfananko, fananko. Ganu la pati yon nyato mkolu. Anina nto la mwolumi ya lanko yikoye mansong. Aliansi la yikoye be koalisono la yining ganu. Mbedende la lako. Yefono. Ka APRC la pati yon la simbololo. Akola na la simbololo. Keke ila political programs. Niyake. Mbe, mbe sengara le kambake Ani nga fengwa 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 mbake lale Ka mekso ko mwote yabla wola Nko fana nko Kuma le fota Babili, babili mansa ko Amang, amang nyin Alliance endorse Amaka la mwote Nko, nkalta nteni ala tema As a Muslim, ko babili mansa yaya jamia ya kala mutole. Isu shamba fanya la kunu biya fanya manso mamba la wola, ba kala mutole ba liya watiji. Ko aketa me aketa watu mina mobile o mimi bedi amola bila uspika le usman rambo yankuba koli ibesi limbe tu global. Ko kote yuko ngamu ge jam. Ana kwa kukele Awa kinkani Puru nying alianz kuo Amari bija Mtato Tonko nying ala tem Billahi Ayaka la mtato Lafta ngoo sani yami Nko kabo bila Momo ya lo nko ibe Nyi no alianz Mini kwa imansom Ida abeje Ani ye plazo soto na stocho lto. Wole mu ye plazo soto aida chateo la plazo, ee chateo to. Wada wado to. Wada mkonsekwensi to. Wada mdijono to. Wada national executive. Ngo kabo bila. Ibe la o plazo lo. Nga table. Ngo. Regional care manual ni la desk officer lo. Ya mekso ko nyunkuo kakome ngadi ya tamandi. Ya jibe plaso plaso be mobulu miya longa begi nukonole. Ya plaso bondi yefedeke yomo yomo shenda noto folo. Bani lafta kwa njila. Mamo bai pati yoko. Mamo bai pati yoko. Ini nite dokuwa kenula. Chodo nito kato dokuwa ke jora ngolo minna. Wote nito otule buluko. Pati yoko mbele be deni wala folo. Bani plaso be mwomo bulu. Ani idai begi nukonole. Ila plaso. Kabo bila ngatale, ane ng directive mindi yake. Nko, wara misa tambila, ng executive mitu wa kijani. Fenne miya longo, fenne bige mimi kambenta la, nko na secretary ya kwa kijani tena lumo, alia mexo kwa alia oldeda, alia kiimari moli. Ba ala yake, ada misa lumo arujumo nindi ya moket. Bari waman bondi waman bondi kumbi minke la mbake kan wala mundi unko kabo arujuma lungola aramisha lungola sorry honorable Abdul Jaju mi alonga tule mu na national youth mobilisadi na plaza tabul unko ndola youth structure. 
I mean, I mean, we have the National Youth Mobilizer, we have the first Deputy National Youth Mobilizer, and the second Deputy National Youth Mobilizer. Welcome. We call the first Deputy, Minkita Parmesan Dauti, whatever is the at La Plaza Hotel. Parmesan no one member here, whatever is the council of Fatu Jaloti, whatever is the at the Parmesan first Deputy here. Bakar Saibu. Bakar Saibu Sane, it will be a national executive member. But if you have a question, you can ask the APRC national executive. You can ask the development slit. Muhammad Lamin Jami, I tell you, the deputy COP, the chief of protocol, I tell you, but I don't But comment, because you can comment, you can ask the question. Nga bondi na forum tole, ezegadi forum tole. Because na kisikisi dalu, na kulomo lu, ya inatani sobindi ko, atereka kibaro bondi janka samba bantala. So mko mkana kukede, nga bondi ye. Nga bondi ye wani mbi tema. Ntada mwana na manna ya kafanyo ko, na security o, na intelligence o ezegadi manna ya kafanyo na kibaro kafintili. Bar nata je ko nim komiti omi ya londi wo arjuma lumala ato bejele anunga fala ko momo dabo wo lbol kono ila plaso lunge be 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 talang be 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 bondla ngole fa mami so wakam Muhammad Lamin Jamme na bondi ala deputy chief of protocol ya lale muda kudenge na bondi kabo na kabo APRC the National Executive Committee mimba ramplas la boki baro dila lale nyato. Ko momo mamo bay momo ibe namule bang fe ibe dula dula bay ila fe ibe na fe na mura APRC intul bay intul la bunda kumo bayel boling nanta sonda ko APRC is a stock dot party party ole minna la tarambulo le mana la dual le ko intul ning NPP la alliance bole nambulo di nyola mo kile pru Gambia la interest okang Gambia la temku okang Ani gambi ala nyato taka, ani tulbe. Nung jikita ko abati na walio mbe gambi yangu kultema, aba aba walio tala la lewarang ayabang. Nko mbaya fula APR sin kulbe na militano, mini mini na sympathizers na members sumulu. Ani gambi yadi wao gambi yadi mi ya longo ilafta gambi yala. Kuni nindi zamba fourth kate finala alinga na kate kuso di president Adam Abarola mi ya longo atole mungi flag biara of the alliance wakpuru ni mungu kama pula na banko nchi tangu mo soto ane yuroa mko mbe mkontanta mbe kontan droke la wali sano kuno GPDP uh, NCP, NRP, and of course NPP. Any independent be ni la nyato la nyato ngo ni la kafu dumo le be control. Baro be kola, ngombe President Adam Baro ba control number ten tulamba jaila. Ala nyato ngo ya dikol minga suti ato kang skatuma. Ala hamu kani mbango kama moja kikilimoti moja kwa ala dimbayati anunuka tangu mo ane yuwa sababu ndi mbango kama unkontrolide ni mafu alakom 
bilem bilem de kununti ñu alliance sotu andum on paratal de kolya kolya be sulo kam payta ka takin ngol ni ngol la ka bondi ñaato fo la tamin na ngaato nakuma la baw wala mu ngamol min tofo yalon ndol min be siri ndiam mol le be ñedu lal ku jamal ka ke tub ko fata ji mol le ka do ku wo molun ko nge tentu nge jay wala ndumati you are al ba joko dukure anala des officer pa amadou sousso ani la molu be min be jay min be do ko wala eprc mbe tentu la mbe jay la kabir nga be kol yalla ni tol len fobi crr al haji esa jay len kiyama noti ani on revolu seni mbay lem des officer ti ni la molu min be be crr mbe kontol na mbe tentu la ay la baro la nbr alaji omar drame atlem kiyama noti an kansilo parlamin jiba atlem des officer ti ni la molu min be be nbr nge kontol nge tentu la do ku nyimala lrr stafa sabali atlem kiyama noti al haji suleiman sisse is the des officer al nalla ka fu diwol ni molmi bebe je ngal konto ngal ten west coast region ngom hakilo e alagi solo mar solo marema na kiyama no mi yalon ko ala yasam be be duwala pour ala sa du jannatul firdaus be alagi karamo koli kiyama ani honorable alagi sanku jamme des officer ani west coast ko lu be eprc ngal konto ngal ten tu abe koliari na tol len fobi Kalifi Kalifi municipality Mamadou Lamine Dramé Kiaman an pa Ibrahima Sonko des officer ana la KMC kafo molu be ngali konton ngal tentu Allah kata ko wala anina capital ba banjul Cheikh Kiam Kiaman an honorable Ablaye Sen des officer anin bangunum ko lu be ni tentu ngay jay nabus kafo lu na national women mobilize ajara tu asadu jifanga jaju ana no malanko ajaratu mbeli sow ani gambia musolu be eprc ngal konto ngal ten kal atollem eprc ni ni julo national youth mobilize pa matar ndaw an kansulo deputy anis deputy kansulo fatu jallo ana la fonding ke kafo be ngal konto ngal ten tu allah kata ko wol national elders council ke apasin be jam ajaratu beti sen ana no malanko ajara alaji palum ani la kafo molu be gambia tonkon fo tonkon ngal kontong ye tentu ila ila kata ko wala ah di national student swing mi ya longo fabel jajule ya jaton kaya mbe konton nan be tentu lam be jayila ngko na kafo lu mbe angal ter ba tuba abdu american na kiyama no be je ka fay jibril fadia mbe ngalon ne gentleman par excellence mba kontona ni na mol min bebe america a angal tedi banko kan usman panjaglem a very principal man ani na mol min bebe angal tedi ka fo dimol min bebe je bebe kontona be tentula eu babandin talem ani na ka fo dimol min bebe je bebe kontona be tentula be jayla ngko be kontona ro kere kere la na mol la nga kato fay minie wala na député wolti nga mini samba député bu ngato ani na kansulol mi yalla ngo ka kato fay ke samba kansulol mbe tentula mbe jay lay tol len tol nyaal ci ndulato ani ngi la kata ko kala mutale mbe 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 tentula mbe jay la ila kata ko be la ngon na aprc security yolu ba toru na la pa matar na la molu protocol ba toru ci na la molu finance seni mbay na la molu logistics by ibrahim sonko nala molu di biro uh, pa amadou suso anin muhammed lamin kansulo foma kansulo muhammed lamin baji dara molu bara be kum farao ñu di be min ka be jijindi wolem di mobilization wo kam be aprc la national mobilization general mi yalla ko atlen na foma meyoti al haji yankuba koli mba tentulam ba jayla anala no malanko obama baji passé ni baji mbé kontone na mbé tentulam mbé jayla mbena kontone do la banna jumalto ibe aprc te aprc be yalon 
kerajaan ada balen general lord. Walaupun di APRC National Coordinator General, film masal general bakar gate bakso. Bari mbala mbela filara rank do tala bulle. Kadu tuman do na finga tuwa meno da kamuru kaje la kita kom. Bakarin be konton nan be ten tulam be jaila. Tonya 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 forole muiti ya kata nyim patiwe. Ya kata nyim patiwe ni. Mbadi ngolum be min fura mobe. Dia mobe siarim bant. Mo kana it mo jau mo jumal te minke kamfan. Nko anna tre ka ka baden duro saji gi saji gi jolon dan kan. Alinga sabar wota. Muslimo nin dinanto for Christian or Muslim ibuka nin dro ke banen dro ibuka ke ibuka kangola mo kan dalila tebulu mint modol be kedon dum ala dunya fandi mo si falle da ate mo be kedam mo kendot bala to dunya be fanan kedam mo kurumot so nko APRC nin ko limin be kedin ten alama ko la kedan tol be an nim banko e kairot nko mol kam min fo bi keda na forma president yaya jam nko ali ngang hakilot ay nyaton ko ya gane nyaton ko ya fengum bu nyalde anna ta te wultale kan nem fang di ko re nga 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 nyakas ale mil long jongoto wo nyante wasalale ndi lafta wole fulale mbali konton na mbali tentula ko mbe nga wuli do ko sitale nga mexico ko comme december 5th ni amo wi gom ye jang president adama barwo na la alliance mondiale mbal ten tula mbal gey la thank you very much dio dio thank you very much right when i go la i come back and in to my agenda i now told to be the houses and journalists I know most of you will mount our watering for question and answer session. But we will give you the opportunity to ask any questions as we usually do. Five books. That today Five books. we are at the APRC so guys there. compared to our previous press conferences where we rented places and time was very, very limited to us. But as the rules always go, Identify yourself, which media that you represent, and please ask one question at a time. If the opportunity comes your way again, you'll be able to ask another question or other questions. I want to appeal, don't put two questions together, one question at a time. You will have the opportunity to ask other questions as we normally do and to introduce yourself. I will begin by hands will be raised. Thing I have first one at the back. Thing this mic can be passed around so that those outside will also be able to hear your questions yeah. one at the time. As the gentleman standing. Um, thank you very much. My name is Dauda Balde from the Fatih Network. Dauda Balde from the Fatih Network. Um, from from the statement made by Fabagare Monjata, you said um, you believe Jame was misinformed or misadvised. Um, why do you think so? Okay, thank you very much. Yes, that's my personal belief. And why do I believe that? I believe, honestly, to myself, that no normal person will take a knife and stab yourself. As I said earlier, he was in the picture. He had agreed. He had talked to us. Only for the last moment, for, for things to turn around this way, I can honestly only attribute it to ill advice. That's my decision. Um, thank you. Uh, 
Thank you very much. Can we have the next question? Okay, you have the mic. All right. Yanku Bajalo for air. Uh, sir, um, sitting here, now you are from... Uh, sir, now I have, I have injuries, I'm, I'm protecting. Um, sitting here, like, you have, you have alliance with a NPP. And now, uh, Mr. Jai, you used to tell people that there have been a lot of parties that have contacted you. And uh, you would like to know which parties have, contacted, have ever contacted APRC for an alliance before you settle with NPP. Yeah, thank you very much. You know, the process is, when, we, when, when parties come and they want to meet the APRC, what we did was we, we, we have created committees that, co that parties would discuss with. And then that, that committee will come to report to us whether there is need for us to go into an alliance or discuss further with that uh, party. Among the parties I know of is this GANU itself. In fact, I have in my office, I think so, a document from GANU leadership, the man who, who, who established GANU. He's in the U.S. He's a Sarahule man. I have a, I, I have a document from him. Dukure. Dukure. It's with me. I have it with me. So we had, uh, our, our people had, uh, had discussions with them. We had discussions with GDC. GDC. We had discussions with this GDC. We had discussions with ANRD, that's Lamin Bogans party. So we had discussions with, uh, with, there were people who contacted us and we were not very keen. Gab. Pardon? Gab. 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 So what we are saying is, what surprised us is, all these things were happening well before uh, NPP. No newspaper was interested in it. Nobody will talk about it. It was not, it was, I have not, I have not heard it from any person. But when he came to NPP, <laughs> it became a crime. <coughs> no, but I never mentioned to people that we were in alliance with NPP well before. But they were talking about it. The press we are picking it, everybody was talking about it. I never told them that we were in alliance then. So why not these other people? How you got that one? Why, how, why, why? Are you keeping it? And then when it came to NPP, you say, ah, let's blow them up. That is the only reason I'm asking. Thank you, Honorable. The next question. Yeah. The two of them. Ah, OK. Thank you very much. Good afternoon. This is Keba Ansumani from the Voice newspaper. Uh, Honorable, I would like to know what must have changed uh, because going by the 2018 APRC Congress at BM, uh, the resolutions once says the Congress elect and adopt the President's Professor Dr. Alhaji Yahya AJJ Jamme as the Supreme Leader of the APRC until 2026. It went further to say it, we also recommend that all executive powers of appointing members of the National Executive Committee to be vested on the President, uh, Yahya AJJ Jame. So I want to know which powers do you rely on to dismiss some of the members of the non-alliance movement? Uh, and to add up, uh, to add up, mm, one I want by to one. One yeah, just, it's a, it's a no, you will continue. You will continue. A question, yeah. No, but you will so, continue later. Very good. It's just a pregnant question. I just completed it once. I want to. Uh, President Barrow has labeled you as a. No, 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 no. That is a different one. Let's clear this one. Answer this. And then you will come. We will give you a chance to answer that question. Now, first of all, your statement is incorrect. As illiterate as, we may, as illiterate as we may be, and according to the laws of this country, especially the, uh, the various electoral acts and the constitution of the Gambia, we cannot go and make statements that go contrary to those statements in our BM 
rally. So that statement is not correct. Two, two, Congresses go up to two years. Whatever decisions we had over, t we are taking in Buyam, the decisions are then our last Congress decision override those decisions. Paradise. At paradise. And when next we have a Congress, and they decide to say that, myself, Bori, we are out of the national executive, are we going to rely on the paradise decision to say, no, we are not going, we are told at the paradise? No, we cannot do that. So you cannot bring about that Congress report to affect us after another Congress today. But what I want to make it clear is all what you read is not true. It must be written by people or whatever. We are I'm not in disagreement. Even our MOU that we signed with Barrow, we saw it in the papers that this is the MOU. Different, different. Different, different types. So that statement is not correct. So nothing, nothing has changed. Yes, uh, you are, let, no, let give, him, give him the other one to finish wait, wait, the, wait. please. Sorry, yes, sorry. Let's clarify one more thing. Hmm? Some, some people, I just want to clarify this. Listen, listen now. I believe all of you present here have heard what the party leader said. We did not dismiss or sack anybody from the party. Let's repeat that and let's make it clear. People who held positions, positions. and are now with the No Alliance Movement, those positions cannot be left with them. It belongs to the party and it must be handed over to other people so that they can serve the party. We want to make this clear. And secondly, this Congress resolution you are talking about, it's not from the party's Congress, but it is Lamin Tamba who is circulating it. You cannot have a flag bearer up to 2026 when every two years you must go to Congress. That's not even logical. Thank you. No, let him complete. No, I, I, I promise. I promise. I promise. You, yeah, I promise. You mentioned something. I told yes, you that. Yes. Yes. Uh, I am saying, uh, President Barrow has labelled you as a very loyal personality since he first met you in 2017, courtesy of Sidinjai. Uh, do you feel happy now that Usainu Dabo and his UDP are no more part of the Barrow-led government? and APRC are also into an alliance with the NPP. I, Is it payers answered? I, I will collapse today if this question is not raised. <laughs> <laughs> My number one answer, you know, I don't listen to audios, and I was not at the meeting in Sukuta, because there. I was briefed. But this, because of this statement that people were telling me, I listened to that portion of what Barrow said. I want to ask. Barrow said, Wolungolan, a conte for my future, a comforter. He said it. He said he was not happy with my statement. So, how can you construe if I tell Barrow, 2017, Intending APRC binalang nga lalikam. Would that make him unhappy? Would that make him unhappy? No. No, that would not. I said, it's very clear, and that's, that's our principle. I have said it a million times. That we are a party on opposition with a difference. That we believe in leadership. Baro is the president of the Republic of the Gambia. He's our president. That one is clear. And that's what I told him. And I said again. If you do good, we support it. You do bad, we cry foul. I said to him that for me, I will never be UDP until my, on the end of my life. <laughs> and I, my last words to him were, you yourself, let's go. UDP will disappoint you on the way. <laughs> this is what I told him. So people said, I had people, who, I don't listen to your audios, unfortunately. That's why I don't get disturbed. So people are telling me, Iko Baro Iko Kabiri in 2017 year mortgage. With all that, no Baro mortgage. Baro only year middle income January from from that time to now. I remember 2017 that period. I was the majority leader. I was the majority leader up to April 2017.
You know, people like to find loopholes and holes. <laughs> we were an opposition. We could have gone, we, you know, we have number. Politics is about number. And the only way you can get our number when we call people. When we have those numbers, we can do anything. But we refrained, we exercised restraint. A lot of things happened to us, unjustified. Hardly do you hear media comments. Very few. If mentioned once, twice, it dies out. I know it was because the concept, the perception of APRC is in their heads. They cannot forgo it. That's what I believe. But we struggled under it. We kept, we kept calm. The only time people come for APRC is when they see a dot on a white sheet. So for, for, me, for me, nothing has changed. And you know, you know that I am Mandinka. Yes. I am Mandinka. Yes, my father is Mandinka, my mother is Mandinka. Uh, but you know, people like us, we are many. You cannot be schooled and you live on this globe, you call yourself a Muslim. You think in your tribal, tribal lines. That's the bane of Africa. And political leaders use it for their own personal interest. No Mandinka leader will come and distribute the wealth, the wealth of our country to Mandinkas. No the fuller or anybody. Let's look at people who are competent to service us all and we give them our, our district. Thank you. Next question, Omar Ba. Can I have Omar at the back? I said Omar, Omar. Omar, Omar. Omar is behind you. Omar is behind you. <laughs> okay, um. Okay, go ahead. Omar, you okay. don't have a question? <laughs> That's why I said you, because the next is not coming to you. I have Abdullah here. All right, thank you yeah. very much. Uh, Mr. I'll come to you. Yes. Thank you very much, Mr. Jaya. Um, Omar Ba of the Standard uh, newspaper. Um, Honorable um, Jata. Um, the IEC, of course, have cleared their part in terms of, um, I mean, the IEC have cleared their part in terms of their position uh, on who they recognize as the, the leader of the APRC. Uh -huh. Yeah, I, now, go ahead. Yeah, I mean, the IEC have cleared their part on um, who they recognize as the leader of the party and, of course, which executive is legitimate as far as the IEC is concerned. But what is not clear uh, to many is... What does the um, APRC uh, constitution say about this issue? Who has the power to dismiss or dissolve the executive of the APRC? Who has the power, power to, to, to dissolve the entire executive? Bring, bring it. <laughs> Hmm? I don't know what warranted this question. Because is it, is it as a result of the Friday pronouncement? Because let's be clear APRC is a structured party guided by laws. And any of our laws that go contrary to the supreme laws of the land, the, our, those laws will be declared null and void. I am not aware of those laws. But what is clear is APRC as a, in our constitution. APRC executive positions are elective by the Congress. Some of them are appointed uh, by the leadership. That is the party leader, first party, second party leader coming down, admin, uh, general secretary coming down. We have our structures. So I don't know what warranted this because you, know, you said IEC has cleared the way. IEC does not decide on their own. We all know what, is, what, what our law says. Mm -hmm. So whether IEC says it or not, we know we are the legal authority of the party today. That's so the other thing is, I don't know what you are basing it on. Is it because, that's why I asked, is it because of the Friday pronouncements? Yeah, what, what we are saying is, the APRC, as per our constitution, the executive 
is appointed uh, by at, at a congress, some of them. Others are appointed by the leader as per our constitution. That's why I want to, I want clarity on the issue so that I'll be able to give you examples. Huh? The supreme leader is an, honor, is an honorary title. It has no powers. It's an honorary title. No, it's not even part of our our decision. We recognize that our 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 former party leader and our president, who who has been here, we recognize that, and we know that at the time he could not be a leader of the party, and then we want to honor him, we want to respect him, and we gave him the title, the honorary title of supreme leader. Which one? Which one? Which one? Um, next goes to Abdullah. Welcome. Well, assalamu Well, Mr. Jata, you made it very clear that uh, if uh, no, uh, you you made it very clear that if uh, the breakaway faction continue to use uh, the APRC color and emblem, they will be taken to, to to court. We all know that the December election is fast approaching. Don't you think that uh, taking, this, taking the matter up with the court has the potential to distract your troops and demobilize them? Thank you for that question. We said we are going to use disciplinary action or legal action. That's what we said. And uh, we will use any other means for no, for, uh, to prevent anybody from ridiculing us. Whoever you are, at whatever cost it may cost us, we are a disciplined force. And we don't believe in indiscipline, and then we leave you because we may lose you. No, we don't believe that. Thank you. So, I'm coming. I think uh, you I don't want to do this matter. Like John, instead of just giving this up. Huh? Like John. Mm. Yeah, okay. Yes, All right. So, for those who, are, who have gone to NAM, that is non alliance, and go probably want to align with Kano. I have said in my statement that we have not expelled anybody. We have not removed anybody from the party. And even if you have gone, you are, you are welcome back. But we don't want indiscipline. We don't want indiscipline. We are a disciplined force. And we believe we reach where we are today against all the odds because of, because of our faith in Allah and our discipline and respect for authority. Most people were even don't want to talk about us, our good side. The, more so the press. Some of the press, they don't want even to listen to what APRC is saying. It's only when it is controversial. Yeah. But we, we succeeded. We came to this level. So we are urging from myself downwards, we should all continue to be disciplined. Avoid insults and castigation. Politics is about war... Uh, the war is about battle of ideas, not insults. People who insult don't have ideas. So for us, we have no intention to take anybody out or legally or discipline anybody. But if we are forced to, we will do it. For Ghana, we are clear they don't have right to use our party symbol. And anybody going to their gathering or you are aligning with them, you have a right. But keep away from our symbols. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, thank you very much. I'm Isham Walo from City Limit and uh, Upright Media. Um, um, the other camp, uh, that's the Jame camp, is saying this current executive is only interested in the government positions. That's why you are not saving. Is only interested in government position. That's why you are not you are not saving. You are not. That's why um, this the other camp. That's the Yajami camp is saying that this current executive is not um, um, is not um, is only interested in government positions. That's why you are not safeguarding the interests of the party and its supporters. That's the reason why you are defying Yajami, which has never happened in APRC, because you see Yajami as a spoiler, someone who wants to spoil your chances here. Yeah. Us. Who wants to spoil our camp? Uh -huh. Spoil our chances because you see, people. thank God, thank God, all those people speaking in the camp, in the no camp, 
they should thank Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and thank us. Otherwise, they will not be speaking about APRC today. <laughs> Where were they when the struggle was difficult? When we were going, we were looking for people to give positions. We cannot give positions. Where were they? So we don't listen to them. You know, Mandinkolko, Nemo Kultala, Momo Mindia Tekol. We cannot avoid that. But I said to you, and I will continue to say it, whatever you say in my absence, put us together, you will stoop. I will never stoop for anybody. How can you tell us that we are only interested in positions? <laughs> when we were taking up the mantle, this mantle, none of us expected that we would even be uh, accepted by Gambians. We were hunted down day and night. Everybody ran away from us. Even friends don't want to talk to you. Even family members sometimes. How can you come and tell us, Palazzo Leatin? Let me tell you, if it were Palazzo and yeah. Nkodo, then we will not be sitting here. We will have gone a long time. And I will tell you, those very people, if they were in our position, we would have lost the APRC a long time ago. Thank you. Thank you. Next question, let me take one at the back. Uh, this one? I will put one at the time. Uh, somebody's calling me now. Yes? Um, good afternoon, everyone present here. I am Mariam Kamara of Hamza Bayo TV. Um, my question goes to Mr. Jata. Mr. Jata, you've mentioned that uh, there's some of the executives are poisonous to the APRC camp and you've ripped them off their position, isn't it? Um, so do you have anything, um, any plans laid in order um, to stop them if they fight back? Because we all know that this will cause negative um, vibration. This group? Yeah, it will want, cause negative vibration. The one, negative the vibration. one that we remove from, our, from the... the when, they, when they retaliate. Yes, when they retaliate. You know, uh, thank you very much. I, 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 I think, I think, I, I think, I respect your, the way you describe them, poisonous. But I don't think I said poisonous. Never, never. <laughs> but that's your opinion. From what I have said, you have used that they are poisonous. Now, you see, in the game of politics, who had ever thought that President Adam Abaro and lawyer Usenu Dabo are going to part? Who had ever thought that when Yaya Jame was declared non-winner, so many people took their warambas and threw at him? Who had ever thought they would do that? You see, politics it's is that dead. type. That's why some people say it's dirty. It's not dirty. People are dirty, and dirty people make it dirty. So what I'm saying is, yes, they have a right to whatever retaliation, whatever. I don't know what type of retaliation you mean, whether they are going to fight us or what. But I don't, I don't think so. But we, we, we are thick-skinned. We had been bad all our years. We were in the opposition from 97. I am sure the, the, the UDP and others were looking for us. They were trying to find every possible way how to get our nose down. But I said we are clean people. I don't mind. You can use force on me and allege against me, but you will never prove that Fabakari is that bad. I am not a wicked man. I am, I, I, to the best of myself, I think I am honest enough. And I am not politically blind. I don't, when I was in parliament as majority leader, I had, I wield a lot of powers, as, as the technocrats. But I deal with everybody on the merit, even whether you are opposition or not opposition. They know it. So what I'm saying is, we have done this with clear consent. You cannot be within the executive. We respect that you have, you disagree. We respect it. But after the process, until we concluded, you still want to be a rebel. Where can you find that? No. The due process is complete. Unfortunately, you cannot win many people. So you have lost. So if they retaliate, we, 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 we will see what is necessary. Uh, ne the next next step. step to do. But as I said, this party is a disciplined party governed by our regulations. Anybody who, take, who, who thinks you can hold us at ransom, 
you were making a mistake, we will use the full force of the powers vested in us and our laws to deal with situations as and when they arise. No doubt about that. Thank you. Babukar is next. Babukar Babu, right behind you. Uh, Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa ta'ala wa barakatuh. So I am going to quote so that you don't want to give me the microphone. And I have been raising my hand. Uh, thank you very much. Uh, Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa ta'ala wa barakatuh. Uh, my name is uh, Babu Karbahum, representing the MPP Media. Uh, Baba Kare, I want to put these questions to you. What is the position of the party as far as uh, the former president is concerned? Because uh, if you if you can if you can see uh, the former president is speaking to this executive, is speaking to the other section, so it's it's like it's causing a, a confusion in the party. So what is the position of the party, or what is the position of the party as far as the former president is concerned? This is what I want to know. Let me just let me just rectify that. Yanguba, we invited you said any media, anybody who can send the message out, we invited them. Not only to the press, but we extended invitation to them. That's why they are here. Let me clarify that. Yes, go ahead. You see, uh, despite what might I think I stated in my statement. Despite what might have happened on that Friday, I said for me I said I think he has been misinformed and misadvised, ill-advised. I said that. But I recognize one thing, and I said it. I said, Yaya Jame has been our president for 22 years. Yaya Jame has been our party leader for, for 20. 20 years. Just for those two, he deserves our respect. And we appreciate what he has done in this country. He has transformed this country, like it or not, agree to it or not. He has impacted positively on every sector of this country. Yes, he's a human being like all of us. He has his shortfalls and shortcomings. But what our position is, you see, as a party, that's why we made this, we, we made this declaration. We answered, we, answered, we, we, we answered the doubts of people. And the steps taken by the executive, we declared it. Subsequent steps will only be necessary depending on what comes in next. Mm -hmm. But I said now, or oh, even those in the NAM group, they are, we, are, we, we, are not, we are not removing them from the party. They are members. If they, if they choose to go to uh, Ghana or any political party, for Lillah we have no qualms, but we are urging them to come back to their Green Party. They can fit nowhere except the Green Party. So the other thing is, st things come in uh, by steps. We don't want to predict what they will do or what somebody else will do. But whatever you do, you find the national executive ready and will use appropriate measures to put things to order. Thank you, Honorable. I will sway the mic on my right, then Alaji, you'll be next. Thank you very much, Mr. Ja. I am Paul Lamin Fati from LSTV1. Uh, my question is, um, after the pronouncement uh, of the former president, Yaya Jame, at his hometown in Kanilai last week, uh, some of uh, the APRC uh, top brass executive members took on audios, went on social media to use abusive languages on the former president Yaya Jame. APRC as a party, do you have any plans in cautioning these people to make sure they stop using abusive languages on the former president Yaya Jame? Thank you. I have, I have, thank you very much. I have said, and I think I will repeat it, under no circumstance, not only even the senior, the senior brass, APRC, we said, you are disciplined and you are pious people, either Christian or Muslim. Let's fear God. 
Let nobody prompt us or tempt us to use foul language or to, to make statements that are not distinct. We have said that very clear. We also respect people who have opinions. People have opinions. We only prevail on people to exercise maximum restraint. But I know we are all human. Sometimes we, some, of us get, some, some of us may get emotional. But the, the best of people are those who are able to put down their emotions and allow reason to, come to play. So those who have done it, I can assure you they have regretted it. And some of those audios are not audios meant for public consumption. And all of us here, Komakumaro is part of our social fabric. <laughs> Someday I will sit with Dudu, I will tell him, here, he like you, the body walk. I will say something that if body is there, I will not say it. I don't mean evil or anything, but I, it's how it happens. If that unfortunately goes out, and then the person regretted it, and he's not meant for that, what do you want him to do, or the person to do? The best you can do is to be honest to your conscience. You accept and you regret. That's all we need. But I want to prevail on all, all of us, including myself. Let's exercise maximum restraint. Thank you, Honorable Alaji. Uh, good evening. Th thank you, do that. At least now you <laughs> give me the microphone. Uh, first, Honorable, of course, we know within the APRC constitution. And if you look at the hierarchy of the party, uh, there is no title like an interim leader, a deputy party leader, supreme leader. But of course, uh, we have some of these titles now. First, let's say, uh, making the APRC supporters and militants to believe that Jame is the supreme leader, and whilst you are the interim leader and you have a deputy leader, is that the beginning? of the fallout i mean if that is the beginning of the fallout between your late executive and jame because you made him a supreme leader legally within the aprc constitution that title is not there an interim leader title is not there but you make the aprc supporters to believe that this title are existing is that the beginning of your fallout with jame can we say that also that is the beginning of politics of deception to the grassroots realm level. How can uh, it be the beginning of the fallout between us and Jami? Well, I, I can. you will answer to my question. Am I not right? Pardon? That's why I ask a question. I will return you the microphone. Oh, you are not ready? give me your answer. You are not ready? No. Uh, and I also want to know, what are the legal basics? No, no, no. No, no, no. I think we should make it one question after that. That's what we agree. No problem. Yeah. Answer, yeah. We will give you, we, we, will, we will give you the opportunity to come again to clear all your doubts. But let's make it one at a time. I'm happy to have a one-on-one -on -one with you. Ah, okay. So that at least you can clear numerous questions to me. Because I spoke to the other side of the camp. And they've levied a lot of allegations on you. And I want to have your response. Thank you. That's, those are allegations. Yeah, thank you very much. You know, uh, the other, there is no, you, you call it a camp. The, the leadership of any institution is the executive. I think you should know that. And by, by all standards and all means, from, from, from the beginning of our operations, when we came here to discuss about the alliance, only one person, only one person, how do you call it a camp then? From, from out of 52. How do you call it? I, I don't understand it. Yes, you may, they may have, a camp is, when the executive is gone, or my deputy or two other this thing gone this way, we have two camps. But within the rank and files, you have them in this thing. They cannot be camps. They are rebels or they have gone to join another district. They cannot be camps. There must be division from the hierarchy that can correct the camps. Some people can come and align with us, for instance. They may come as APRC, probably they are not APRC. They may be in their thousands. Only for them to come and form a camp like that and rebel against us. You call them camps. No, I'm not deviating. I'm explaining to you. Please. No, no, no. No, 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 no. Please. With all due respect. Please. 
if I am ready and your question is not answered, then you tell me which one you want to know. Yes, so. huh? All right? So calling them the camps, for me, is not a camp. Two, your idea that the issue of Babili as supreme leader, interim leader, can be the beginning of a crisis. That's what I don't understand. Because making Babili a supreme leader, how can that make Babili otherwise for me for to have crisis with us? I don't understand it. I don't understand that juggle. And yes, you may not have these titles, but the party has rights to give titles to people. people of course. These are only the titles. Interim in the party, if you go to the last uh, Congress, Congress that has changed from interim. <laughs> so, but what we are saying is, those are things uh, in terms of, I, I cannot understand how, those are not born of contentions. Anyway, why do we make Yajame the supreme, supreme leader? Or why is Fabakari either interim or this? That's not the born of contention. The born of contention, to my knowledge, according to the digital I had, is that he has not been consulted on the, the alliance. alliance. And now he has taken full ownership and leadership of the party A, B, C, D. That's what I understand. So for me, one, the camp issue, I'm not, uh, I, don't, I don't call it camps. Two, I don't, I have, I don't believe that the issue of uh, uh, sup, uh, supreme, uh, supreme leader or a interim leader can be the bane of contention or the beginning of the crisis. I no, I don't believe so. No, let him please. Your please. question yeah. answered. No, no, let him. He's got, he has another one. He has. I, I ask him. I yes. Ask him. Okay, the mic. You also know. And uh, and uh, you also said something. That you you said you said you want to have something like tete a tete. Yes, yes, because huh? when I speak to the general, no, 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 no. Come, he's asking, "Do you want it?" Yes, yes that's yeah, it. I will be more than happy. If you want, I will be more than happy. All right, if you one. want to have tete a tete with me, just walk through him. Yes. Okay. I go want ahead. to hijack you today to give you a special program yeah. tomorrow. It doesn't work. But anyway, well. let's go ahead, honourable. Of course, uh, you a lot of people today, when they had the APRC is going ahead with the press conference. Uh, they were thinking that the APRC will take step today. I mean, that's your, uh, 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 you, the, the executive that is led by you, that you're going to expel Jami uh, from the party. You know, but instead, you relieved the likes of Abdul, you know, and the like from their positions. But you did not expel them from the party. What is stopping the APRC expelling Jami from the party since he has gave, according to other people, a divisive comment that has now brought a rift between the APRC. Yeah, thank you very much. Most people believe that we are going to expel Jame, and that we are going to expel most of the leaders of the, uh, the no-coalition movement. They have a right to think that way. You see, every institution and every leadership has its own style of disciplinary measures. We are aware that we are not, we are in administration, yes, but this is political administration. I have told you in my submissions that immediately we sign the MOU and this one is taken, their right to rebel within the executive ceases from that time. You either design or you throw the line. But we let them go. We never talk to anybody. We try to go into the people to try to explain, because it's politics. Some people we believe may, may be misinformed. Some people is calculated. Some people, they have other agenda items. But the thing is, we have the final say. And when the time comes to do those things, we will do it. But we have no intention to expel anybody. They may come from people. People may think it that way. Even some of us may think it that way. But that is not the decision of the executive. We believe that uh, the, the statements of Babili that we are made, that we know of, we stand in them, we, 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 we clear the air on them, and let people be informed. Because it's not always when people go against what we are doing, it's your enemy. No, 
our, our, how we, how we uh, analyze and see things may be different. So we respect all this. But anything that goes to finally put us down to, for, uh, that is not in the greater interest of the party, we will act when the, when, when the situation arises for anybody and anywhere. So we have no qualms about that. Thank you, Honorable. Let me make this clear. I want to give opportunity to every media house and journalist here. I cannot give somebody three questions whilst somebody else doesn't ask a single one. This is why I am identifying those who are yet to ask a question. Give them the opportunity. If it's exhausted, then you can come second round. So I want to send the mic this way to this lady. Then I'll come back. Next. Okay. Good afternoon, everybody. Um, yes, uh, my name is Suke Ijajusi. I'm from N24 TV. Um, my question is direct N24 TV. Yes. My question is directed to um, Fabaka from Mungyata. Why did you deliberately refuse to comment on Jame's decision to dissolve the executive? Thank you. No, I have not deliberately. And I, I think I have said it. I have said categorically that me and my executive are in control of the APRC in the Gambia. I think I said that. Yes. And nobody can dissolve us except a, uh, at a Congress. Yeah. I, th I think that is, that is very clear. You know what some people may want to hear from me or from us? We will not do that. If you want to hear that, you will not hear it. Remember, I told you, we, we were in government with him as our leader for 22 years. And we was our party leader for 20 years. And not that man could do it again, could do it again. So now, I'm going to tell you. But it's a Tonya for the morning, I'm going to tell you. So we are very, we are very, we cherish, I said it here, we cherish what he has done. We appreciate it. And I told you, for me, it's an opinion, it may be wrong. I think it's ill advice. Ill advice. Ill advice. Some people who advise him, they advise him wrongly. Anybody who loves him, loves the APRC, would not advise him to do that. Thank you very much. The gentleman behind Yamba. Thank you very much for giving me the uh, chance. Uh, my name is Sirif, uh, Sirif Conte from GTTV. Uh, last Friday, uh, Jame made it very clear that he did not uh, recognize your alliance with NPP. Today here, uh, Mr. Jata also made it very clear to those, as you call it, uh, non-alliance movement, that they should not be using the party's uh, colors, things like that. Now, are you also ready to stop using Jamis images during your rallies and meetings? Images during your rallies and press conferences? Thank you. No, no, no. You heard me. You you heard me say that the non-alliance movement Gano. and Gano most all use our party, party symbol, party symbol and color. That's what I said. I'm not saying let them not use Jamie's head. I said our party symbol and our party color. Now you ask whether we are able, we are going to refrain from using Jamie's image. I said, has James told you that we should refrain from using his head? If he has done so, then, we, then he has a right to, stop, to ask us to stop using his image. Can I talk? You can talk. <laughs> it, is, it is very clear that James said he is not in alliance. 
he is not uh, he does not recognize the alliance that you are going for with the npp and also jamai recognize those who joined the ganu now you tell them to stop using the color the party's color that's why i ask whether you are also ready to stop using jamai's images it's a question no you see the, Sorry. Uh, you know there are two different things image belongs to jamai the color green and the symbols belongs to the party I'm a uh, Jame was leader. He may not be leader tomorrow. I am leader. They, they may be using my image, and tomorrow I may not be leader. So image is belongs to the individual. If Jame tells us not to use his image, he has a right, and we should stop using his image. But the color of the party, I said, is a Gambian party belonging to Gambians. The party, the party symbols. Uh, the where the party is? Those things is the is the party APRC. If I leave the APRC, I cannot do anything about that. Succeeding generations will determine what they do with the party, according to the due according to due process. So what we are saying is, NPP, uh, uh, sorry, uh, Ganu, and those people who associate themselves with Ganu, APRC legally is in alliance with npp led coalition and we are the only authority who can determine that for after after consultations with our militants so what we are saying is is very clear we are very clear so the green the symbols that belongs to the party not to me it belongs to the aprc party and that should be safeguarded by any authority inside if I to leave today and go to another party, that that symbol I should not go with it. It should be it should be protected by uh, the the party itself. So it has nothing to do with that. Thank you. I have one down here. The high five. Hello. Assalamu alaikum. Um, Tatum Ibrahim Asankoldi. Um, coming you know, as my family, more than my my family. Um, honorable, honorable, not even in Kala cooking, Nala, cooking name on confusion in the Monday. Well, in the country, my family, 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 Ya je menen talo bi tarla gele ba ya dum bang o mu raid le ma fo em eh on debul faba ka to mon jala fo la ci fen ko na talo bi tarla gele ba fo bo bo kilo ci sal kilo yus la bang lap to ni lap to ni ni ka kilo la ha APRC na talo mi ya ya je me so amanta na ya antolia it has been the APRC distinct for that period and material lem like print la print print the mechanism, the due process mechanism to determine what comes next. But this has all been caring. Over individuals, some individuals may be so annoyed that they don't want to, they don't they may not want to use it. Some people may be so good and proud that they want to use it. But it's not entirely among 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 It's fine. Yeah. Thank you. Hello, coming from Mali. To the extreme. Yaro ninga tsa yaya jame mo modoli timi manke nata modoli mimi manke yaya jame. Mbe minke la nimbe minfu la no nimbe minke kate kila kilimo. Because baringalo nuko dunia kuku funga nyobu nyato. Anu ngalo ne hala bade yaya timo tige. Nkamru kono kedi la minna. Tuma nondi ka kuke minja wiyato. Iko afile sumo sumo sumo. 
local people will not will not will not know how to make money from them. So these are all facts of life. You are a sutra, don't you? A sutra. You are a tenual. So when coming from all the things, you tell me how to tell you. Yeah, yeah, me. I can tell you, party all the things you are doing. Sanji Muang and Infula. No failure. I can tell you, party all the leaders. Sanji Muang. Ba. I can tell you, you are not a man. You are a drunk. Bora buya nga fale tonya manke motati wo mu alatati nim tonya o sita be tonya folale bar tonya fo manje ko be bulala morale ba nen na wore ba fengela wore ba kajabila but the fact no we will say that dr moli will understand thank you honorable it's been long that the mic go but let me send signals i will take few questions and we'll have to allow him to rest yes that's true um thank you once again um, my question is now that the APRC has been divided into two groups and you are the leader as you claim to be um, What efforts are you putting in place to ensure unity among all APRC supporters that it has been known for? And are you ready to engage Jamie? Hence you believe that he was misinformed or misadvised to make sure that you bring him back on the track Yeah, thank you very much Yeah, we have splinter groups within the APRC and for that matter, in most other political parties. Political parties, if you look at the like, political participation, always you have these ups and downs. We, we believe, as an executive, that it's our, it's our responsibility. They want to hear from us, they want to ask us questions. We've been going. We, even that day that he was making this declaration in Kanilai, we were in Guyab. We are explaining that that mantle is with us that we must explain to the people. Even those people who are criticizing us or insulting, we must explain to them. After we explain to you, then Alhamdulillah. That's what we are doing. Yes, uh, for Babili, Yaya Jami, yes, if we have the opportunity, we will talk. This is a political game. People with us today are no longer with us. That is, that is, that's politics. So politics, you go for the opposition. You go for those who don't want. You, you market your ideas. You give them reasons. The very people who are insulting you, those are the people you want. Trying to get anybody into the Green Party. And for that matter, if you are not a member, I want to start with you to come and join us.